Hey guys, uh, welcome back to Super Lucky. And this episode, we are on Magic the Gathering. This is a box of Modern Horizon 2. So, we revisited this set is because I'm looking for some singles for my modern deck. So, cards to chase for, let them shot off. It's probably like Solitude, Fury, and a couple of like fetch lanes. So, I'll say that this is still one of the better sets compared to like Streets of Cuphead. So I think this is like week 2 of Streets of Cuphead. It's really like boring to open that set. So why not, uh, you know, uh, chase for something that is a tournament worthy type of cards. And guys, uh, this booster box was bought off from my local store, Hideout. So this is a new magic uh, store in the eastern side of Singapore. So this is my... Uh, Magic community friends, uh, Edwin Lim. So do visit and check out his Facebook page. A very good of a uh, uh, casual collective uh, of EDH players. Uh, do visit his store regularly for games, you know, cut singles or any products. Just uh, swing by. And what brings us to his store was actually a dinner over at uh, Soy Forty Seven. So here we go, guys. Hunting down for some of the staples for my modern pioneer deck so probably going to be playing a little bit more competitive games uh, in the time to come so a little rusty but i do need to get some of the singles so with those chase cards being so highly uh, in, in a good price of the market so why not uh, give our shots okay i'll start all right we have sujen in the house Yeah. All the screw things, yeah. It's the same. It's the same. Okay, I hope I do hit some of my chase cards that I want. But uh, well, let's see what comes along. So thanks to Hideout for this box. Also need to say, uh, Hideout has very very good inventory, so they have a lot of items. So if you want to revisit some of the old collection, um, yeah, do check them out. Okay, so let's go. Wow! Oh, first okay. mythic! First mythic is our da Dacon. Dacon. Some of the Dacons. Okay. Seal of Cleansing. Okay. A Chromeba. And a Common Foil for Watcher. That's all. Alright. Okay, there's probably no need to sleep for MTG cards. <laughs> Unless we hit a super nice card. Alright. So I think last time people used to like count like how many how many fetch lanes. So same thing. Let's see how many fetch lanes comes in our this episode of box opening. So okay. Here we go. The base cards. Over here. Well, split cut. Fast and furious. Sit and done. We got a Merc type region, guys. This is the top tier one that one of those chase cards that you want to have. For the second mythic is out. Yep. So this is one of the chase cards that the tournament staples you will want to have for your deck. All right. This is the basic. Wow, the Merc type. Let me sleep it. What is the price now? Um, I think this is, I don't know, maybe the last recall I saw is like maybe like $40. Whoa, okay. Yeah. Or more. But there's one like uh, a monkey cut that is worth like 90 bucks. It's monkey a red colour cut. Hero? No. <laughs> oh. Let's see, we have a rare Fractured Sanity. Double rare. Diamond Lion. Triple rare. Curse Totem. Okay. Three rares in a row, man. Yeah, sounds like a triple Q. <laughs> Alrighty. Alright, uh, what about this set? Is we have a sketch card for it. Oh, so, okay. there's a sketch card series. So, these are the regular rares. Okay, cool. Alright. Pack number three. So, so more therapeutic. Like, we used to buy, buy like one or two packs of, you know, just to speed off to get the uh, stuff that we need. So these are the art cards, these are like basic. 
Commons. It's gonna sweep through fast. Any turn Raptor. Squirrel. This is the set of the Squirrel lot. We got Todd Monitor. Affinity. But second rare. Chance Encounter. Third one. Oh no. <laughs> Two rares. On the top of the Paradise. And we got Stone God Oracle. And a card from the list. Alright. Hey. Okay, let's go. Whoa, uh, autograph card. Oh, oh, I, I missed that. Totally. You see the point? Wow. <laughs> nice. Why do you know what card is it? By tell? Yeah. The telly? I have no idea. But it's hot stamp. Yep. Okay, I'll just go through quickly. Out of time. Alright, the showcase version. What should I put here? Yep. Okay, first uh, Rare Hero, the Volatile Uncommon Oh, another one Marble Dunkoli And a Bone Shark Bone Shark Coin Alright Alright, here we go Switch through fast Fast break over here Vertical Gloves Ah, this one. Sandifier and Wreck. A very nice retro card. Guys, we got a scouting card in the house. Woohoo! First fetch lane. Next one. Um, Mockcon Scream and a Terror Storm. Oh, we got another foil. Kaleido Scotch. Alright. One fetch lane is out. <coughs> How many fetch lanes are there? Um, we don't know. <laughs> uh -huh. Let's uh, let's see. Oh. Let's see what are the better hits. Hmm. Here's a frog. Oh. Yeah. Why was that? Okay, anyway. Let's go through quickly. I think for this they have the like the retro frame foil type of cards. Harmonic so. Prodigy. Very uncommon. One shot again. Oh, but in the retro frame. Oh. So these are like old school frame. Oh, we got the first rare foil. Petrarch's Reading. It's a reprint card. Okay. A rare foil. And this is an Enclave Clologist. This one here. This one is the least card. Least they, have card. A, they have the symbol and the side. Okay. They are looking for the old cards. <laughs> Alright. Um, two mythics, one rare foil out. So let's go, guys. Let's enjoy. This is one of those uh, value sets, I would say. Um, Alright, Revenant Squirrels. Alright, Archon of Cruelty. This is also uh, you know, one of those uh, probably uh, bad cards that went up in value. Oh, Termitic. Yeah, Termitic in the box. We hope for more. Angelic uh, Phantasmo. Disciple of Sun. Yep, that's all. On a sunny day. This is the sketch card, right? Which mm. is uh, another common card. Where should I put? Oh, uh, together with the common card. Oh, okay. Alright. Guys, I need solitude for my deck. One piece, please. <laughs> mm. Solitude, solitude. Here we go, guys. Oh, so fast. The uncommon pack. It's probably an uncommon pack. Okay, we got Synthes, Harvest Hand, Search of the Premises, Sea Drake, and What's Behind? Nested Shambler. And a Slack Book. Oh, from the list card. Okay, 
Okay, let's go. Oh, Ooh, another one. Nice. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, red. Damn. Damn. <laughs> Damn. Second, second rare, Sterling Grove. Liquid Mental Talk. And Rift Sour. Sour. Void. And you got one card behind. Oh! The list is a list card. The list card, yeah. Goblin Assistant. Okay. Alright. Alright, guys. Wow, super endurance. Lots of boosters. We are only like one third in. <coughs> so come on, more fire for the cameras. <laughs> and. Oh, also chasing the cards that I need for my modern deck. So far, not much. Prairie Scouting Suns is what I need as well. Okay, first one, Suspend. Alright. Um, next we have Extruder. Agony. Toss. Alright, just one red. Metalsis, Mistra Factory, Goblin, other Cormenza, <laughs> <laughs> and uh, this is uncommon. Young Necromancer. Yay! Nice. All right, all right. So there's a lot of packs in this one, like thirty packs, <laughs> thirty packs, or oh, probably thirty six. I, I can't remember. So after so many packs, we got a basic for forest. Calibrate the Blast, first rare, upheaval, second rare, Galvanic Ray, for the old foil, and we got the relearn. The reprint. Alright. Sketch card series. Yeah. That most bleach. So uh, only the first EA extended art has uh, showed up. So we haven't seen anything for the retro frame for So hopefully more to come. Uh, you know, for you guys. So shiny, so cute, Spiro. We hit the point the other time, and here we go. Moderations. Uh, sketch cards, rare card. So I just put it together in the rare pile. Sanctum Weaver. So snare. And we got Urban Dagger Tooth. What is the card that you are chasing? Solid Nuke, Fury, and maybe a couple more. But the one that came unexpected was the Merc type region. Okay. Would you use it for your deck? Uh, no, I won't use it. Okay. Wow, so Shit. close! Red Shit. card, but I need. Wah. Yeah. Greed. Mind collapse. Hellmonger and blah. There you go. Still a lot of uh, chances left <laughs> at the back. Plenty of chances, so yeah. let's get some food on the table. Okay, these are the comments. Alright, gonna go to oh, Abundant Harvest, very nice art. So, Squirrel Set, Squirrel Century. We got Cheeto, Speedo, uh, Scratch Familiar, Underworld Hermit, and uh, Abundant Harvest. Nice card over here. Come, let's do a Fetch Lane. Foy. Foy. Yeah. Let's 
Dyer's wheel. Yes! Koi <laughs> is a fetch lane, Eric Messa. Another another rare, oh, triple rare. Enchantress, Enchantress presence. presence. I got a slow soul snare. Whoa! Oh, wow. Guys! Yay. We Thank hit you. it! Mythic points out! Oh. Thank you! Ooh. Guys! <laughs> Chef's kiss. I need this for my the new Kiki Jiki Sahili <laughs> combo. Oh my goodness, I saw it off uh, previously, so now I find it back. So Guys, we are super lucky and that's not the end. We still got two more piles of cards. Because a, a single piece alone it's already cost me like 90 bucks. So like you know. it's still in a foil format? Yeah, so at, in a foil and then it's probably gonna fetch a little bit more in value. Alright. Yeah what's but the, what's the value now actually? The foil I probably don't know. But the regular one is like $90. <gasps> yeah, Ooh. so you know with a little bit of those mythic that I need for my uh, mm. decks, right? I mm. might as well, you know, like go in on a That's box true. to to pick it. So and then the other card, the, the, the card was Fury, probably it's around like forty to fifty dollars for the mythic slot, huh? So here we got Lunis, Crypto Zoologist, Void Mirror, very nice a sideboard card again. So a lot of pickups over this it will be very useful for the tournaments ahead. Uh, coming soon so for the year lah. so yeah yay she's so, so excited yeah 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 oh man i was super overjoyed when i see solitude foil yay. i'm already contented with a basic one but uh, for my modern deck i do pay foils wow <laughs> shiny That's shiny nice, uh. oh my god shiny island yay <laughs> Mythic, 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 what's this? Oh my goodness! Whoa! Double Solitude! <laughs> what are the odds? Oh, oh my goodness! Gosh. Yay! Double kill! Guys. Guys! Oh my goodness, now with two, I can make it a deck. Comic Guide. Kitchen yeah. M. Revolutionist. Yay! Yeah, these are the two cards. Uh, it's part of the combo deck that I'm playing as well. So they come well together. <laughs> So just give a check out, I think Andres Mangucci on his YouTube channel, he's running a, a combo deck like this that has been doing very well. Yeah. Oh my goodness, guys, uh, thanks Edwin. These are the, you know, cards that is hiding out <laughs> in your stores. Hide out, you know, the very catchy store name for, 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 for people to remember. Okay, guys, it's still not the end. Like I say, uh, let's see what came in further. Fury, right? Yeah, but I'm still short of Fury. Okay. Or even like what's the green card? Uh, uh, there's one green card also, a green mythic. Okay. Yeah. Can't remember the name now, probably by then. I should recall. Some start with E one, I can't. It's a mythic. Territory Kavu. Alright. Blacksmith skills. Alright. <laughs> oh. SJ is back on the streak, man. Yay. Opening up all the Yay. good stuff. Dress down? On a weekend. This is the longer cast. I have no idea how to pronounce that. Oh, triple, triple rare. rare. China. Prophetic Titan. The point. Oh. Okay. oh my goodness, guys. Alright. <coughs> come on, Fury. Come on. Um, what's the E card? I can't remember. Ah, Eternal or something like this. I think so. Okay. We'll find out later. Yeah, we'll find out in a while. <laughs> or, okay, the point shiny, basic yeah. lane. So, okay, guys, these are the basic. And the world hermits. Oh no, Esper Sentinel. So this card has potential, good value as well. Okay. Esper Sentinel. Oh uh, no, <laughs> oh yes. Oh yes. Uh, Abundant Harvest. We got Void Mirror Foy. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Rare Foy. Yay. Bonus stage, bonus stage, guys. Is that, is that the 
Oh. I know, this is just a toy. Burden command. Okay. John and Bond. You usually have a good card. Oh no. You pack. <laughs> Bloodhound. Another rare boy, guys. A blue card? Moderations. Moderations. Okay, you came in moderations. Yeah. Alright. Nice card. <coughs> I kind of lost track, but I was uh, probably just sleep out all the good cards. Yeah. Hey guys, uh, final laps of this box opening. So here we go. Almost. Okay, Terramorph. Rise and shine. Uh, wow, cover coffers. <laughs> oh my goodness, guys! Ooh. Another mythic. So this is a super nice um, set, I would say. Bone shards and bone shards boy in the list card. Root runner. Fury, where are you? Yeah, Fury is a mythic. Mythic. Yeah. In red, I suppose. Yeah, if I, I can't open it, probably I just buy it. <laughs> oh, because I, I I got the most important card I want. So oh, okay. I'm glad yeah. I want help. <laughs> yeah. Alright guys, down to the final 3 packs. Timeless sweetness. Oh, Academy Manufacturer. So I think this is also a card that has risen in value. Flame Tongue Yearling Moon Strata for Classic card from the Azar Legacy Hey, this is the final pack Good luck, Jen okay. Will you hit the Fury? Fury Or a green card, right? Yeah okay. Hope you see the one Interesting. Oh, legendary. Dark one eye. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of mythic okay. in this product. Alright. Blacksmith skill. Oh, I got a double. Yeah, retro frame foy. And a mythic. Oh what my is? goodness, five. Whoa. Is it the same guy again? Okay. No. Crested some Oh, this is the least cut. Yay! <laughs> oh my Not goodness. Bad, yeah, that's why I think a lot of places are started to sell out on this product. It's a very good uh, set, uh, I would say. <laughs> so guys, uh down to my final, final pack. Uh will you get I get more pieces for my modern or pioneer deck? Fury, Fury. Fury starting off with a red mountain. Got chance. Alright. Come on, come on. For the mountain, we got ink on our heat. Okay, for the cameras, uh, unholy heat is also one of the playable staples. Green stone. We got necro goif. Nephthys. No, there goes my two chance. I still have one more rare chance. Toy slot chance. No love. Some curator. That's my ending card. So oh, bella. Oh, yeah, thinks, guys. Let's do a quick recap. So, I, I mean, I'm with the money I spend buying singles and uh, opening up this box is also very close. So, for the basic rares, uh, these are some of the hits, notable ones. Uh, we didn't hit uh, cards like the Urza 
plan which probably will kind of help you cover quite a bit fair bit uh, so these are just some of the uh, basic cards uh, that I hit so February I didn't do very well on the basic series okay so towards the foil I think foiling these are the whole huge decks um, probably in terms of the future you get something so one retro foil I don't know whether is it one per box um, yeah these are the old school retro frame cards and guys down to the iconic hits okay let me pull them together let me pull them together oh, lots of stuff yeah it must be fair I'll sleep up all the mythic <laughs> to be fair to be fair This box is quite a few mythic. Yeah, so guys, just run through from the list card. We hit the mythic, maybe for the uh, EDH fans. This card might be useful for the horse, horse fans. Oh, okay, let me sort the foil rares. Okay, foil rares, guys, we hit uh, three. Three foil rare. Two regular, one uh, sketch foil. Um, for the... Um, uh, notable rare that makes it it's actually this Esco Sentinel one of those better cards for modern staples and next we have a uh, 3 fetch lands considered not bad some probably is only one or two lands per box and probably these two colors are one of those better ones 3 fetch lands okay guys uh, down to the mythic oh my goodness I'm not really sure uh, you know not a seasonal opponent for Modern Horizon, but we definitely started off with Dakon, first mythic, uh, second mythic, we got Cover Cover as third, uh, Archon of Cruelty, for Murktide Thief, Solitude as the sixth, and we got an EA, Silver Balloon, Sky and Sea. Alright, so six main mythic and one EA, EA mythic, seven, heaven. And guys, down to the very last card of my Dream Chase card for my modern deck is actually a Foy Solitude. Yay. So super thankful to SJ for helping me to pull this card. And guys, not forgetting, uh, this booster box was picked up for oh, Hideout. Hideout. So do check out their Facebook group or those swing by their stores to visit them. Very nice, cozy, uh, ventilated uh, room, shop that they have. So give them a follow and also give us a follow and thumbs up for this video. So hope you guys enjoy this uh, experience and stay tuned and be back for more future uh, product opening with Super Lucky. So this is us. Bye. Bye